dedicated team of uh, assistants who are very committed to their role here. We really believe that one size doesn't fit all our passengers. They tell us the way that they want to be treated, so we always ask the passenger what way we can help them. There are a number of call points throughout the airport that people can call for assistance. There's also the blue badge spaces. There's a number of those in the short stay car park. There is also an incentive from the Now Group, which is called a jam card. It just gives us the idea that they might need a little bit more patience. We've also got lanyards for hidden disabilities that people can access. Once they get through the check-in process, then we stay with them every step of the way through security. We also ask them if they want to do any shopping or if they need a coffee or tea and leave them in the assisted area. We will be back there with about 30 minutes before their, their flight is due to depart. We're very keen to get continual feedback from our customers. At the end of the passenger's journey, we can ask them if they would like to take a survey. There are also survey cards that we give out to customers and we encourage them to fill those in for us as well. And then the CAA have a survey on the website which we get feedback from. Airport set up an accessibility forum and we work with a number of groups including RNIB, MTAC, Action on Hearing Loss and Guide Dogs NI. We actually host the Guide Dog Puppies who come here for familiarisation training. We do get a lot of feedback from this group and uh, we try to take everything on board to make improvements at the airport. <laughs>